Don't lie. Beth Heiserman from Reyes Winery. How are you doing? Did you get, uh, you came in with your slicker on and your boots. Look at you being all prepared. Oh, it was raining rain. pretty good out there no, this morning. <laughs> yeah, it is. It's, com- it's coming down. Uh, what, there are so many events always going on. You always come in ready to talk about a party. I love that about you. So what are we talking about today? What are we doing? Valentine's Day. Happy Valentine's I Day. Know. Look at you all. You're pretty and you're purple and you got your, is it ameth- amethyst? So what's what's going uh, on? You've got the jewelry. You brought, you're all matching. You're all ready. <laughs> So we're having a party at Reyes Winery? We are, Friday and Saturday night. I love it. Yes. Tell us about it. We're doing a winemaker dinner. It's a four-course meal, and mm. Robert gets to head it, and he's going to talk a little bit about the wine, and I'll talk a little bit about the wine, and each course is paired just perfectly with some of our favorites. Why wouldn't it be? Of course <laughs> it is. Of course it is. You're not leaving that to us, are you? No. We're just we're coming in ready to sit down <laughs> and enjoy. Uh, so give us a little, um, I know you like to surprise the guests who come a little bit, but can you give me any hint on I can. maybe like the food or something? I can. I have the menu on the website, actually. Oh, fantastic. What is we it? Do. What do we got? So the first part, um, we're doing appetizers between five and six. We have our 2010 Syrah and our... What did I pair it with? Oh my goodness, I already forgot the the, the other right, wine that then, I chose. Then that'll be surprise. I think it's the 2013 Viognier I chose okay. for the appetizers, and I'm doing a beet hummus. So every every course has a little bit of pink or purple or red oh, in that's, it. Now, wait a minute, was that on purpose or it just Absolutely. happened that way? I love it. Absolutely. I love it. So I, ha- I make fresh hummus, and I add a little bit of beet powder to it, so it gives a nice pink color. And then I have different cheeses and crackers and different little goodies to go with it. And then we're also premiering um, a rosé cider for the first course. So instead of champagne, we have cider. Okay, rosé cider. I've never heard of such a thing. It's apple cider, and then we blend it in a little bit of juice. That's pink. And there you go. Yes. Rosé cider. Yes. Plain and simple. So that's the first course. And we're (laughs) not even, that's just not, that's, you have four, you have three more to go. What? Let's skip a little bit. Okay. You know my favorite is dessert. dessert. Yeah, 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 yeah. You know me too well. Talk to me about the dessert. Yeah. So I'm doing two different cakes, one to pair with our Rose's Choice Rosé, which is a sweet rosé. And I have a strawberry cake to go with a, um, a filling that I make with mascarpone cream and strawberries. And then it has a cream cheese icing. So it's kind of like a red velvet cake, but it's pink. But it's pink. But it's pink. Do... Your guests who come to these events, and you have all kinds of events going on all the time, do know they know as little as I do. Are they just coming for the fun? Or, Absolutely. Or do you get or do you get people who know like you do about a few? Do you a few, but not really. It's mostly people just that wanting to have fun. Because you know, do it's they come? Experience. Do they come up to you and they go, well, you know, I was thinking, Beth, this this rosé would have gone much better <laughs> with this. Like, does anyone ever challenge no. you? Because no. yeah, I would never. You know, no. And, in fact, rosé is pretty much the only thing. Like, I can say Chardonnay, rosé, and then that's my knowledge. <laughs> and I really don't know what I'm talking about either. That's Those okay. are just words I know. And, and then I have a second dessert. So if you're not into, like, vanilla, I have chocolate. So I have a chocolate cake that has a coffee mascarpone filling with fudge frosting. And that's going to go with our Agua Dulce Delight, which is our dessert wine, port. Port? Port. Can't be what any is, better than what, that. What is port? mean it is a dessert wine that's been fortified with grape alcohol Mm -hmm. so it is a little bit higher in the alcohol level there and so instead of being around 13 percent it's about 22 percent that's which is high for a wine it's high for a wine yes okay so we might want like a cordial we might want to do uber yeah is all maybe (laughs) think about uber yeah and so it has um, wonderful notes of different chocolate and dried fruits like figs and it's just so delicious to pair it with chocolate. Fantastic. You're ready. <laughs> You're set. What should we wear? Oh, something comfortable and warm because of the rain. Comfortable and warm, but maybe, you know, throw in yeah. a little red or pink. Let's, Absolutely. It is Valentine's Day. Come on. Get it together. Absolutely. Uh, what What do you usually, uh, do you act as a guest when you're there or do you get, uh, are you hostess? I would say I'm more hostess. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. But do you get to partake? Do you partake in the... A little bit, yeah. A little bit? A little bit, yeah. Good for you. Look at you. You got it all. You have this great business and you get to party with the rest of them. Absolutely. What should we know about this Valentine's Day dinner event that's on the 15th and 16th? It's tomorrow and Saturday. Mm -hmm. What should we know? If there's one thing we can tell 
our listeners about this? What would that one thing be? Other than to have come and have fun. Absolutely. What would that be? It's just an, an amazing experience to have a winemaker dinner, to actually have someone guide you through each of the courses and tell stories not just go and eat, but you get to actually hear stories about the wines that we're pouring and why we chose them for you to share. That's fantastic. Yes. So it's a, it is an event. It's just not a dinner. Correct. It's an event. And how it fun is. would that be? So grab your sweetheart. How do I get tickets? Website on right. our event page. Right. You go right, right to our event page and it's chronological. So it'll be the top event because it's next. Racewinery.com? Absolutely. Yes. And then it'll say buy your tickets now and it'll take you to the link to actually purchase your tickets. Easy. Yeah, absolutely. They're $65 a person. Can't go wrong for what you're getting. $65. Yes, per four person. Cor- four course meal. Yes. The stories and the pairing of the wines. Absolutely. Bargain. <laughs> Bargain, Absolutely. total bargain. Fantastic for you. Beth Heiserman, you know it's always a pleasure, right? Thank you so having much you in for studio. having me. Be careful in the rain, will you? I will. All right. Happy Valentine's Day.